I have regained control of the platform, Shepard. I knew you wouldn't let us down, Edie. I always work at optimal capacity. Did you get what we needed? I found data that would help us successfully navigate the Omega-4 relay. I have also found a Turian distress call that served as the lure for this trap. The Collectors were the source. It is unusual. It seems logical to me that they would have sent the initial message as bait. No, it is unusual because Turian emergency channels have secondary encryption. It is corrupted in the message. It is not possible that the elusive man would believe the distress call was genuine. Why are you so sure? I found the anomaly with Cerberus detection protocols. He wrote them. He knew it was a trap? Why would he send us into a trap? We don't have time to throw blame around. We'll question him when we're out. This is a bad time to become an optimist, Shepard. Uh, Commander, we got another problem. The Collector ship is powering up. You need to get out of there before their weapons come online. I'm not losing another Normandy. I do not have full control of their systems. I will do what I can. Sending coordinates for shuttle extraction. Come on, let's move. Mass Effect Dose. Insanity difficulty walkthrough by Ares for my website, which might be changing in the near future, which is kind of what I wanted to talk about in this video. Um, this is kind of a uh, simpler level. It's kind of just fighting the collectors. Uh, I'll pop in with relevant information. Here I was trying to pick up that ammo, which it did not want me to pick up. Um, but I wanted to talk about my website and... Um, this kind of goes back to the history of how it was started. Um, I actually have a friend who has posted on this uh, website a little bit. Not on this website, on this YouTube channel. He's posted a few content. But uh, he is he's quite lazy and he, if you will, have a, has a life. Which uh, I can't really say so for myself. Um, but, uh, so I was tossing around the idea of a website and he decided that we go ahead and make one for the channel. Um, the only uh, the only hitch on this was that he started it up and uh, right when he did that I told him that I did not want that and he went on this huge complaining of why I didn't want that and made this huge fucking deal about it of why it was such a big deal that I wanted to start it up myself and, uh, so he has complete control of the website. Now, he is lazy, and if you want to know how lazy he is, um, go to the website at the time of this video being produced and, uh, check, uh, the, how updated the guides are. And some of them aren't even on there. Now, he won't let me post, um, just because he's an asshole. Um, he just is. He, wa he wants control. He's a control freak freak just like I am but uh, the kind of difference is is that at least I'll get things done so he won't let me do anything on the website and um, yeah so I've just gotten to the point where I I don't know do you guys think I should just go ahead because I have no um, right now we're just about to get our first check for the website so what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna say anything until then to him and then once I get the money I'm probably going to um, probably start up my own website, but would you guys care about that? Because, um, just, if I made my own website, then it would get much more updated than it currently is. So, if you guys, um, are okay with that, like, if, well, I'm not okay with that, if you guys would prefer that I would just, you know, do an, uh, my own website, because it would probably be changed, like, darkdownproductions.net or .org or something like that, or I would make it, uh, make it something.com. I could... I have a very creative mind. I'm sure I could find something. But do you guys think I should do that? Um, and don't worry about anything like that. I could, I can get all financially set up. That would not be a problem for me. But uh, are you guys okay with that? Uh, I just want to know if you guys would really care. Or do you not care that it's not being updated that often? Because if nobody cares, then um, I have no problem with keeping it the way it is right now. Plus, with the current website, I'm having to, uh, he is, uh, greedy. <laughs> that, that was kind of my other reason, and he wants 50-50, even though he's not doing, you know, shit, which, that's kind of my main problem with it, so. 
the website might be changing soon. Um, I'm just going to not put the website in the sidebar anymore for most of my future videos. So, um, because there's no point, just because the website's not getting updated to the point of playlists. So, this time I'd like to say if you want playlists, go to nextgenwalkthroughs.com because they have my playlists and they are actually updated more than my website, which is uh, kind of pathetic. So yeah, that's uh, all I wanted to talk about in this video. Um, so I, I really don't see a point in talking anymore because I'm, I've just been kind of keeping this all, uh, what do you call it, all, all, uh, all in my mind, and I just wanted to call it through in a voiceover. So that's uh, my way of communicating with the fans. So yeah, uh, that's all I really had to say. So and now I'm kind of pissed off. So you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna speak my mind. So I'll I'll just leave the rest of this video to you guys, and I'm gonna go go off. So. Got it. Uh -huh. 